What is going on YouTube? It is Flashback here, back with some Dirt Track Racing 2 after a very long hiatus from recording. I do apologize, my life has been incredibly hectic the last few weeks and I just couldn't get my recordings to work before. And we just moved, so I'm kind of testing everything out again. Everything seems to be back in order for some odd reason, nothing wanted to work. Let's see where we stand, we're good on all our repairs for now, no reason to really do anything there. Parts wise, is there anything I can really do? I could do some weight reduction, I guess, technically. Could do some rotors, no real reason. Could do exhaust. Um, don't really see a whole lot of purpose in that. What's the difference here? 100 pounds? Could make the difference in the leaving. Probably shouldn't have done that yet, but oh well. Where are we at next? Our next event is at Peak View. Okay. I have forgotten how to tune. So let's just see what we can do. Bring us down to like 465. We'll test that out. First things first. Let's go into the event here. Enter the event. That apparently didn't cost us any money. Okay. Um, yeah, that should be good enough. Let's go ahead and go into the practice here. And let's see what we can do here in the practice. I am going to attempt to skip all of the uh, loading screens and see how that works out for us. Hopefully I tuned this the way I needed to. So far it feels decent. It's a bit of a wet track here today. Coming through the corners. I think I forgot how to record. I'm actually losing uh, words here. Forgetting to speak, I guess, is what I'd use. Shit, 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 shit. Sorry about the uh, lack of video there. Didn't realize what was going on. Almost missed my turn there. I got so excited trying to get my video back. I Again, I apologize for that. Should not have happened. I'm not sure why it decided to do that. I suppose because it did technically crash when I went into practice the first time around. And now I can't seem to actually make a decent turn here. So I want to get back into recording a little more often. So hopefully I can do that. I've also got, uh, got something else I'm working on. Hopefully I'll be able to release some announcements on that here shortly. I just got to get everything figured out in terms of uh, how the background's going to, not the background, the, uh, God, what's the word I'm looking for here? How all the networking's going to work with it, I guess, is how I would say it best. But hopefully I can make my next idea come to fruition. I think it'd be a great thing to do, and I'll just stop teasing you while I'm ahead. <laughs> get it? Teasing? Head? Ha! I don't get it either. Don't worry. So I think I may have gone slightly... I think I actually need to go slightly shorter in the final drive here. Definitely feels just a tiny bit too long yet. Which isn't, which too long isn't necessarily a bad thing, but on a track like this, you definitely won't, don't want to be too long. You'll lose any sort of top, no, 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 any sort of top speed you would have had, and at, at least it's just practice. I can dial in the tune a little bit here. Color seems to be a little off my recording. I hope that's just because it's on my other monitor here. I'm guessing that's probably it. This is actually my first time recording Dirt Track Racing 2 on my curved Samsung monitor. I gotta tell you, it's pretty. It's very pretty. The cracks, uh, the broken gauges all look the same, but that's about it. I like, I never noticed there, like, right dead center of the car. I guess more on the right side of this view. There's something that says, don't touch. Interesting. Must have been too lazy to pull the wires on it, I guess. Who am I to judge? Oh, my. Oh. That was cool. So, now that I ruined this lap, let's see if we can make it up in the last lap of practice. We'll have to uh, finish coming around for this lap here and see what we can do with that. Oh, oh good lord. I'm definitely not as fast as I could be, though. I'll tell you that much right now. Oh, I almost had it, but I kind of came in a little harder than I really needed to. Got 
Come on, keep it going, keep it straight, keep it straight, and go, 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 go. Yeah, not too bad, I guess. Holy shit. I literally just lost all steering there for a second. That scared the crap out of me. Hopefully it didn't damage me too much. No, I didn't even count it. I'm okay with that, I guess. So we're definitely gonna back this off a little bit more. Really? Okay. In that case. Let's bring these down just a little bit here. I don't even remember how to... Again, I don't remember how to do any of this anymore. I'll do that for now. We'll kind of see how that works out. I want to do some hot laps. No, I think I'm okay. Let's just go on to the qualifying. Hello, qualifying. Clicky, clicky. There we go. Now we're loaded in. We're going to find out if we royally screwed up or royally made it better. Definitely seems like I royally screwed up. Plenty of get up and go, though. I'll give it that much. But it is most definitely topping out a lot sooner than I wanted to when running at a very high RPM. Over 8,000 RPM, which, I mean, isn't necessarily that high per se, but in a V8 circle, I mean, circle track engines are made for it, so. Did I actually, I actually blew up. Wow. <sighs> Just realized when I crashed, I didn't fix, I didn't uh, actually add any parts. So I could probably fix this. 40 bucks, really? Oh. I honestly don't think there's any coming back from this. But, I mean, we can give it a shot, I guess. Just see what we can do. But I don't think it's going to be much. Although, I suppose technically it is nice that they did allow me to do 10% of an upgrade. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, now we're getting some speed. Let's do this. Come on. Am I actually getting ground here? I, I, I was actually getting ground there. Oh, shit. This is actually a way to, to cheat the system, really. I think it might be time for a new engine, though. That much is for sure. I can't believe I'm not losing them by more than this. I wonder if I can actually figure this out enough to start catching up a little bit. It seems like I'm catching up a little bit. I don't know if it's really enough to matter, but... Nope, I just got lapped. Yep, yeah, no, that's it. 
So I'm not going to make you guys sit through this. Well, maybe I will. Hello? Okay, so after all is said and done, I did manage to pull a 22 second time. Well, technically 23, I guess. Which, I mean, wasn't necessarily off par, but yeah. If I kept that up, I probably would have beaten these two, but I ended up just destroying my engine again, so... I'm just gonna skip the rest of the event. It's not really worth my time at this point. Which sucks. I wish that wouldn't have happened, but... Oh, I can accept a new offer. Take Olfen for 210 for 5 events. Good deal there. Let's go ahead and repair our car here. 400 bucks. Oof. Leave that where it is. You know what? You guys deserve another race here. So we're just going to go in 41st Street. Enter the event. Continue. Tune. Bring this up to, like, here, I guess. Yeah, that'll work. Pop it down to, like, 5.6. See what that does for us here. Now, I'm going to go through the practice myself to see where I stand, but we'll be back with qualifying. All right, here we are in qualifying here with our new tune here at 41st Motor Speedway. Hopefully, everything will work out the way I kind of want it to. Oh, yeah, it feels pretty smooth there, right where I want it to be. Seems to be just the right amount of kick in the corners. We'll see how the first lap treats us in terms of time, but it feels fast. That much is for sure. Definitely feels smooth. Yeah, hey, look at that. I didn't even have to try for that. Oh, God, I screwed up the second lap, though. Could have been something special, but nope. At the end of the day, it's going to be nothing good. Nothing at all. But overall, it seems like it's going to be a pretty good qualifying session nonetheless. Whee! So that felt pretty well tuned. I actually qualified us in second. Can I get faster? I think I can. Uh, give me just something. Okay, that'll work. That'll work. Come on, give me like. Come on. That'll work right there. We'll back this down to like 520. That should work. See what that can get us here in our heat. Heats aren't a big deal. I can make my way back up from a heat. There we go. We are starting in last place here for this heat, which is somewhat unfortunate, but we'll deal with it, I suppose. Cup below everyone here. Just say bye-bye. Play with the gas here, try and stay off of people while still allowing them to fight between each other. Amongst each other, sorry. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, someone tapped me and it really threw me sideways there. I actually moved to the side thinking it was going to help me avoid that guy. But, no dice. I think I may have shortened or uh, lengthened the gears just slightly too much. We'll kind of see how, kind of play it by ear here though. Yeah. Oh god. Hey, hey, screw, screw all of you, okay? That is not how you take a turn. You're all making it very hard to drive my track the way I wanna. I'm gonna pass you now, because you can go screw yourself, sir. I'm gonna get past on the inside, I'm getting pushed out. I don't like it. Really? This is mine. <laughs> no. Take the inside, take the inside, take the inside. Ugh. Just slightly too slow now. We'll do that. Hold on to second place if we can.
I know that guy was literally right inside of me, so I had to do something to help keep myself in place. He got past that lap traffic it was a lot easier than I was hoping he would. Okay, not too bad. This traffic is not going to hold him up at all. Great. Seeing a little bit of damage to my engine here because of these high RPMs. It's got to make it to the last lap here. Hopefully we can do so. I screwed with the uh, tune too much. I'm not happy about it, but it is what it is at the end of the day. Yeah, not too bad. I mean, I, that guy really took off there. I don't think there was any way I was actually beating him. Skip to main, skip to my main. Do I need to do any repairs? Yeah, engine needs to get repaired there after that. Bring that down to there. And maybe like a 535 five there should work out. And let's go ahead and get into the race, shall we? Now, we are starting second in the A main, so hopefully that helps us out. But something tells me we're going to get past right away. Yeah, as a matter of fact, there goes everyone. Oh, come on! You see, I'm not used to driving where I have to rely on a tune. I'm used to driving where I can upgrade my car willy-nilly. Without having to worry about the straightaways. I mean, these guys just destroy me on the straightaways. I have to rely on the corners, which I'm not happy about, but... That's all part of being in a higher uh, performance tier than you really should be in. Just slightly too long still, I think. Yeah, just slightly, though. But nothing I can do about it at this point. It's not like I'm going to... Just Alt F4 and go back to my previous save before my engine blew up. That'd be irresponsible. Oh. Alright, well, we're back up into fourth, which is nice. Try and keep it as straight through there as possible. Got two sideways there, didn't keep any momentum. It's running a little higher this time around. Oh, no. Oh. Ah, god dang it. Again, got slightly two sideways there. It's right on my butt. That's a wall. In case you were wondering, that was in fact a wall. I know at first it didn't look like a wall, but it was a wall. There we go, that wasn't too bad. Got through that corner pretty quick. I would settle for top four. I would prefer top three, but I would settle for top four probably. Okay. A lot of times are just consistently too slow here. Which naturally is not making me a very happy camper. That wasn't too bad of a turn right there. Gotta keep it going, though. I'm turning into that one way too late. That's my problem. Ooh, that was a bad turn. Really overcommitted to that inside line there. And it hurt me quite a bit. Not too bad there. They're catching me though. The guys behind me are catching me. I gotta hold them off for as long as I can here. Woo! 
They're right on my butt now. Holy shnikes! That'll slow them down. I mean, granted, my crew's going to be in the shop for the next week and a half, but that'll slow them down. I'm not taking that corner right at all, and it's really killing me. I mean, that time was horrendous. Over 15 seconds. Ugh. Okay, that one was better. That was definitely better. These guys are catching me again. That's how I need to take it, right there. Ooh, a little bit of lag there. That was weird. 1424 is my fastest time of the A main so far. Take the inside line there on the exit. Damn right it is. And don't you forget it. 1419, very nice. Again, 1419. Very, very solid times there. I think I've solidified fourth place. Assuming I don't screw up in this last corner here. Like I almost did. Actually, I did screw it up, but not bad enough. Alright, fourth in the A main. I will take that. That's decent enough for me. Not too bad. Yeah, see, these guys are just so much faster than me in general. The fact that I can actually stay there is actually kind of impressive. It means I'm a little more consistent, or at least really good at blocking. But I made my money back on the engine. That's what's important. So thank you so very much for watching. If you do enjoy this, please remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Till then, as always, take it easy. Peace.